Okay, you're good to go. Good evening, fellow Toastmasters, and most welcome guests. Uh, allow me to introduce myself. Uh, my name is Mike, and I'm currently a student here in Poundland, studying business. Um, it's been a wonderful uh, experience here, and some of you might wondering, how did I come to here as a student, college student? Um, well, I came to Canada about a few years ago as a high school student and I graduated from a high school in Mission and Astra area. Um, it's been a really great atmosphere over there and I really like the people over there. It's very friendly and everyone uh, like to get along well. Um, and one thing that make me feel like um, Make make me feel like really great about myself since I came to Canada is I get to learn to accept new things and I get to learn to learn new things. Uh, for example, one thing is uh, in my high school there's a program called community recreation. Well, it's not an addiction program, but it's actually a program of uh, outdoor adventure. So you go to do hiking. Uh, kayaking, river rafting, and camping, all the stuff like that. Um, it's really fun to go to do all the things with everyone because it, it gets everyone into a spirit of how to do teamwork and uh, how to uh, help each other out. Um, well, in our program, com Community Recreation, um, there's a one thing that is every time before we went out to do an activity, uh, each of us need to do a, um, like a, each of us need to do how to write uh, a certain phrases or words uh, in terms of uh, like when you go to uh, snowboarding, uh, you get to know how to uh, read the signs of each uh, area in the uh, ski resort states that which one is more dangerous, which one is more medium. Um, yeah, so it's, it's very, uh, um, it, it gets a lot of information and uh, it's not just a club for, you know, people having fun, but at all, uh, at end, people get to know some knowledge of it. So it's actually a class. Um, another thing is I, I actually get to do a couple of uh, different kind of jobs for volunteering. Uh, one of them is uh, working in a surf shop. And uh, it's, people over there is very different. They, they got a different kind of personality and they are uh, kind of, uh, I, I mean, they're kind of, uh, you know, professional in each area. Like there's one guy I know that uh, he is really good at fixing electronics. He, he do a lot of work in fixing like stereos and uh, computers. He's like a IT geek, but he hasn't been certified before. So which is, I found it's really interesting here in Canada because you can be uh, such talent or such genius without to be um, certified or, you know, uh, go through a process. Um, and one thing about I working in sweep shop is it gives you some kind of um, um, power, not only to say you work in a search shop, you just work for a salary or wages, but you do work for a kind of a, a charity uh, background, you know, like um, you, you do it for good causes. And you, you know that after you help them out, you do actually help a lot of people around the other world, like Africa or uh, South Asia, like, uh, you know, they, because all of our surf shops funds goes through to others uh, develop, com uh, developing countries, uh, help them build shelters and uh, water pipes. Um, yeah, so I feel like I really feel fulfilled after I work for them. Um, and also I feel like I have some kind of um, uh, experience at working with uh, charities. Yeah, so 
in this process, I did learn a lot of things about different kind of Canadian values, and I did learn a lot of things about myself before I haven't ever uh, discovered before. Um, so I would say it definitely is great experience and it's fantastic for all the time I spend uh, here in Canada, and I really love everyone that I meet, and uh, I like uh, the power and the support they give me too. Um, yeah. I would say I love Canada. Thank you. <laughs>